Hey everybody, good morning. This is Keith from Keith Greer Coaching. As somebody who has been involved in different types of helping conversations for almost 40 years, I find myself thinking often about the people that I work with and the capacities that they bring into the room. There's this model out there that asks us to think about how we treat other people when we engage with them. And this could be either as a, in a helping conversation, this could be with colleagues, family members. I find this incredibly helpful to me as a parent. And the concept asks us to think about, do we treat people as an object, a recipient, or a resource? Now, when we treat somebody as an object, it means that from the get-go, we view them as having no capacity to move their lives forward. They need us to tell them what to do. And sometimes that can feel really good for us because we are imparting our wisdom or our thoughts. But more and more, I find myself asking, is that what is in the best interest of this person I'm talking with? Do I really believe that they don't have any of their own answers? Now, the next level would be treating someone as a recipient. For me, I find this feels, when I've been treated as a recipient, even worse than being treated as an object. When you're treated as a recipient, the person is giving you the impression that they want to hear what you think, but they really don't. At the end of the day, they will tell you what to do. And I would imagine all of you are thinking about either relationships or systems you engage with where maybe you have been treated as a recipient. The goal always in all of our relationships is to treat somebody as the best resource in their own lives. That people have their answers, have their capacities, can come up with the best ideas of how to move their lives forward. And I find as a coach, even when I'm sitting in front of somebody who is saying to me, Keith, tell me what to do that I've come to believe that the absolute worst thing I could do in that moment would be to share with them my thought or my idea of what their next step should be. Because it's simply coming from me. It doesn't mean it is in any way, shape or form relevant to them. And even more important, it would be a subtle message to them that I don't believe you can come up with the best answer. So I will challenge you as you move through your relationships this week to think about how you treat people as their own best resource and what it feels like for you when others do that in their interaction with you. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this, of what it is like to be treated as either a recipient or a resource. Leave me a comment below and let's start a conversation.